Hi there, Tim Bauer here from LiveVideoGuitarLessons.com with a practice tip of the day. This one is for the intermediate player, and uh, today I want to talk about summer. If, if you're of school age, summer's here for you, uh, at least here in the United States. Uh, school let out this week for most of the country, I believe, uh, definitely around here. So anyway, you probably, if, if this is your first summer of playing guitar, and maybe you learned how to play, you know, a few months ago or whatever, and if this is your first summer, um, you probably have big plans to get a lot of practicing done because, you know, you don't have school to deal with and you know you just have all this time you're getting a lot of practicing done I find that the exact opposite is true um, usually people practice less during summer so we want to fix that we want to make sure you do get a lot of practice in alright so one strategy for doing that whatever time you get up in the morning let's say you're gonna get up at I don't know you want to sleep late let's say you want to get up at 10 um, whatever the rules are in your house you know but let's just say 10 o'clock for sake of argument alright so eat some breakfast and before you do anything else, before you start texting your friends, before you go to the pool, or before you go look for your baseball, or, you know, before you go, uh, you know, start looking for new video games to download or whatever, or, you know, just before you do anything else, practice. Because what I find, people do better when they have structure in their lives. You know, when you're, during the school year, you have all kinds of structure. I mean, you have to do this, and then at this time, and at this time, you have to do this, and, you know, um, in the summer that... I don't know why, but I just know it happens. You know, you don't have that schedule, and you know, you, you can always practice. You know, you have all day, and, and before you know it, um, the whole day's gone. You hadn't practiced yet, and now you're tired. So you'll practice tomorrow, you'll double up tomorrow, and then tomorrow, same thing happens. Next thing you know, it's the end of the summer, and you've probably actually gotten worse on guitar because you hadn't practiced enough to even maintain, you know, where you are. So, anyway, so uh, let's say you get up at, at 10 o'clock, eat some breakfast. And your practice time is going to be 10:30 to 11 o'clock every day. You know, half an hour after you get up, you know, um, you know, get ready, and, and you know, but that's going to be your schedule. Everything, then you're done. Then, then, then go text your friends. Then go to the pool. Then go to the lake, or you know, whatever you're going to do, and, and you have your practice in. Um, if you have a schedule like where you're supposed to be at the pool at, at 10 o'clock, get up an hour earlier. Um, you know, then, then you're on the, the nine o'clock schedule. So anyway. So if you um, if you uh, kind of take that as a, as a as a scheduling technique, you'll you'll get all that practicing done this summer, and by the end of the summer, you'll be an awesome guitar player. So anyway, uh, thanks for tuning in for this practice tip. Hopefully that helps. Um, by the way, in my life, I try to practice first thing in the morning too. Number one, I'm more alert. Um, I, number two, I, I want to practice more. You know, if it's three o'clock in the morning and I've been working all night like I have tonight. Um, you know, I, I don't feel like practicing when, when, I, when, I, when I'm finishing up the day. I, I do when I, when I first wake up, though. So, anyway, thanks for tuning in for this practice tip. Tune in again tomorrow for another one, and I will see you next time. Thanks.